I'm Karen Das. And I'm Dr. Visham Bimal from Caribbean Hindustani. We had such a wonderful week. Uncomplicated, trouble-free words. So, so let's go with our first word, Turkey. Lots of people knew this one and even submitted photos. Turkey. Uh, but I know it's more than just a tuft of hair. There's something um, deeper, a deeper meaning behind Turkey. So let's go with that, Dr. Bimal. In Indian culture, you hear something as part of beauty and also important, cosmetically so otherwise. So, um, with regard to the death, often shaving the hair means that you, you're so sad that you disregard the beauty, so you shave your head. But also, in Hindu philosophy, there are points what we call chakras, and the highest chakra is the crown chakra. So, it's believed that that would be like access points of that chakra to the external, physical, spiritual, or whatever dimensions that exist. So it's believed that, I guess, during morning you want to have control of your mind for the sorrow, but not only control regard the sorrow, because, I mean, as I said here, it was quite important. Most people, if you don't know, would leave that choky on and continue to tie it. Because we know it as the, fi- the rights, final rights of the shrad, but it's not always done in that context, and it's done in other contexts as well. Women also, with regard to hair, uh, I think it was in the Mahabharata, Draupadi's hair was her pride, and there was a specific way to describe it. She would tie it, in particular, triple-stranded, coming down to the end and then turn out. And for that same reason of control of mind, so, yeah, the hair is linked to that chakra, and it is said that the physical manifestation that is here also acts as conduits for that chakra into the unseen world. So we move on to our next Trinidad Bhojpuri word. We went with an outfit, Jama Jora, and some said Jora Jama. So the word jama actually comes from pajama. I don't know pajama, what it is in the English word. But pajama is a Hindi word. You wear kurta pajama, kurta, top, pajama, pants. A pajama is black, make it comfortable. Jama comes from that root. Jura is the name of the top. So jura, jama, jama, jura. However you want to say it, describes that specific suit that was worn. Now, one needs to understand how art, like clothing, changes with time based on revolutions, right? So that if you look at paintings of Krishna prior to the Mughal rule in India and afterwards, you'd see that the attire and the style was different. In the same way, um, when we look at modern Bollywood today, again, that is due to certain influence, media, um, what is the powers that be that would... uh, Convinced. So um, that's not how indentured laborers had their bridegrooms dressed. They used to dress them with this um, jama jura, which mm-hmm. is, it was pink in color, same jama as a pants, jura was the top, and the headwear was not turban. Mm-hmm. It used to be like a kind of um, a crown. Round triangular thing. Uh, there is one message from one Viraj Singh. Very unique old style wedding costume for the groom. Usually baby pink or turmeric yellow. Full length embroidered complete with the Mor Mukut. The headwear. Sudhir says Mor. A Mor is, so yeah, Mor, mor is a, a peacock. Mm-hmm. So a Mor Mukut would be a Mukut, which is a crown. Another word for crown. More mukut with the feathered crown, peacock feathered crown. Let's move on to our Trinidad Bhojpuri phrase, Dama Dolwa Kachoka. Dama Dolwa Kachoka. I was surprised that uh, some folks didn't even know Dama Dol. <laughs> I thought that was actually really easy. Uh, but they figured out the choka though. So Dama Dolwa Kachoka. Dama Dol specifically is a Trinidad Bhojpuri where it comes from. Um, uh, tamaras, tamaras in, in Patwa. It doesn't exist anywhere else in the diaspora. Yeah. So, Baigan Kechoka, Damadol, Wake Choka, and so. Mm-hmm. 
So there you have it, Dama Dolwa Ke Chokha, simply Tomatoes Chokha. We move on to our Trinidad Bhojpuri word, Kirki, Kirki. And um, many thought this uh, sounded familiar and made reference to that Ashni song. Right, guys, so Kirki is the window. Kirki Khole Rehe Sari Ratia, the window remains open all night, is quite popular. Romanticism, again, metaphor. And we wrap up the week with a food related Trinidad Bhojpuri word. And we went with Jira. Really nice touch to the week. Dal would be incomplete without Jira. Cumin? Jira in Hindi and Jira, that becomes Ja. It's also an ingredient in masala. Dal, yes, you're chunky with Jira, whereas you would really chunky a choka with Jira. So yeah, important Indian spice. I like jira lassi, um, salted jira lassi. It's yummy. You should try it out. Only one place sells jira lassi. Like I like it. The, the stall outside Grand Bazaar Street Food. Yeah, jira lassi. Great. So we have just wrapped up another episode of Trinidad Portuguese Words and a Phrase. Uh, if you'd like to get in touch with uh, Dr. Vishan Pimal, here's how you do so. Yeah, so Caribbean Hindustani, which is on Facebook as well as YouTube. And then there's org, all available online. Great. Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Vishan Pima. This has been a KDC production in collaboration with Caribbean Hindustani. Stay tuned and be sure to catch up with more Trinidad Poetry words and a phrase. <laughs>